I'm Dr. Lara Marcuse, and I'm here with my colleagues, Dr. Madeline Fields and Dr. Jenna Yu. We're here to talk with you about epilepsy and a special technology we have here at the Mount Sinai Hospital that can help us make an accurate diagnosis and find the best treatment for you. The special technology we'd like to talk with you about is called Home Video EEG. EEG stands for electroencephalogram, which is a recording of the electrical activity in the brain. And EEG looks like this. It represents the brain's electrical activity magnified one million times. Neurologists who specialize in epilepsy can read these recordings that tell us what's going on in your brain. While the EEG records your brain activity, we often use a video camera to record what your body is doing, both while you're awake and while you're asleep. The video allows us to correlate the EEG activity with what is happening to you during an event and helps us make the right diagnosis. Usually an EEG with video monitoring is done in a medical office or a hospital but sometimes a longer recording session is needed and in a different setting. This is where the home video EEG comes in. It can record your brain activity while you're at home and it can record your brain activity for up to 72 hours. It also allows you to avoid the discomforts of hospitalization. You may wonder why that's important and how does recording brain activity and videotaping you at home help us diagnose and treat epilepsy? First, Let's talk a bit about what epilepsy and seizures are. In very basic terms, a seizure is caused by uncontrolled and abnormal electrical activity in the brain. When seizures recur over time, we call it epilepsy. More than two million people in the US are living with epilepsy, and most of them lead very satisfying lives. The abnormal brain activity we see in epilepsy may be the result of head trauma, previous brain infections, a stroke, or a brain tumor. Often, we don't know the cause of the epilepsy. Different people have different types of seizures. A seizure may cause a very slight sensation of nausea and fear, or it may be a bigger event with shaking and tongue biting. Some events appear to be seizures but aren't. Many people are more likely to have a typical event at home and not in the hospital. So we use video EEG to determine if what you're experiencing is a seizure and to find out if you are having seizures that you don't know about. This is more common than you think. This is how the home EEG with video works. You will come to our office and the technician will place the electrodes on your head. The electrodes plug into a small box that you carry. You'll be asked to bring a hat or scarf to wear on your way home to cover and protect the electrodes. You'll wear the electrodes at home during the day and when you are asleep. You will also be given a video camera to take home with you. You'll be taught how to set up the camera and we'll ask you to stay on camera as much as possible while you're awake and while you're asleep. If you have an event, you or a family member can press a button connected to the box to timestamp that exact moment. We'll ask you to also write down the time and let us know what you experienced. At the end of the test, you will bring back the electrodes and the camera. We will look carefully at the recordings and the video to see if you are indeed having seizures and to evaluate if the recordings between seizures has any abnormalities consistent with the seizure disorder. We thank you for this opportunity to tell you about our home video EEG monitoring program. If you are a person living with epilepsy or in need of a diagnosis or a change in your treatment regimen, we encourage you to contact the Mount Sinai Epilepsy Center located at 100th Street and Madison Avenue. Our phone number is 212-241-2627. Mm -hmm.